We're here. We're here with the author of Hey Grand Dude and also noted musician Paul McCartney. <laughs> um, Paul, I understand that Jimi Hendrix covered Sgt. Pepper's mm. just a couple of days after it came out. Yeah. Um, that's ballsy, for one thing. That was very ballsy, yeah. Well, did you know he was going to... Were you there, for one thing? I was there, yeah. It was at the Savile Theatre in London. And um, I was there. Clapton was there. Townsend was there. We, we, like, all come to see this new guitar god. And, yeah, we'd released Sergeant Pepper on the Friday. <laughs> Two days later, on the Sunday, he'd learned it, and he played it. And he, he played it. He played a great version of it. But he had this uh, vibrator on. Mm-hmm. You know, the Bigsby arm on the guitar. And it, the whammy bar? The whammy bar. Mm -hmm. Call it what you will. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and he's going, go, woo, 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 woo. And we're going, whoa, great, great. But we knew, now he's out of tune. Because you're stretching the strings. Every you time stretch the strings. And in those days, that would send you out of tune. So it's his first number. So we, we're looking, what is he going to do? So he starts looking for Eric Clapton in the audience. He says, is Eric out there, man? And Eric Clapton is the guitar god at that point. Clapton is God. Yeah. But Eric is there, but Eric's hiding. <laughs> He's... Yeah. Jimmy spots him. Hey, man, will you come up here and tune this thing for me? <laughs> wow. Those are some brass swingers right there. <laughs> Did Clapton go up and tune it? No. <laughs> Um, oh, my God. Jimmy just had to do it and gone on with it. Um, I know you're, uh, you're, you're here partly uh, because of you have a new children's book. Uh, it's, it's true. Paul McCartney, Hey, Grand Dude. <laughs> uh, what, uh, What's it about, sir? This is about Grand Dude, <laughs> who is... Uh, this all started because um, one of my grandchildren... I have eight grandchildren, Stephen. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations. You have In a fact, <laughs> there they are. You see that? And... By having this photo on the back of your phone, you just proved you're a grandfather. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but at least I don't try and go... <laughs> Some people do. Um, one, of, one of them, um, who shall remain nameless, Beckett, um, <laughs> he just one day said, Hey, grand dude. He, start, he started calling me grand dude. So I said, Well, that's a great idea. And so I, I wrote some stories and then... Uh, these people found out and uh, said, do, do you want to do a book? <laughs> well... As simple as that. Well, now that you're uh, refashioning yourself as the coolest grandfather out there, mm -hmm. um, hey, grand dude, uh, you're off to a, a, a beautiful start here with these illustrations and these stories. And uh, this is available now. But we, we just wanted yeah. to recommend a couple other titles that, okay. that, that you could write. Yeah. Okay. If this is successful, we got some other ideas for you. Oh, I'd, like okay. to, I'd like to pitch them to you right now. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, the first one is uh, Gran on the Run. <laughs> All you need is love and Lipitor. <laughs> I've fallen and I can't get up. <laughs> Back in the AARP. <laughs> and finally, Obla D, Obla Delt Diaper. <laughs> these are free. Yeah. These are, you can take these. I would. I would take the book is Hey Grand Dude. The Grand Dude is Paul McCartney, everybody.